Welcome to Cashbook app. In this video, we will see how to transfer entries from one cashbook to another cashbook. Let's first open My Company Payments Cashbook. Now we have multiple entries here. To transfer some of these entries to another cashbook, we have two ways. Either you can select multiple entries and move them together to another cashbook. To select multiple entries, long press on any entry. Now one entry is selected. Just tap on other entries. Now three entries are selected. Now we have multiple options to transfer these entries to another cash book. We will see these options later. First, let's see how to transfer a single entry to another cash book. So let's tap on first entry, which says Kumar payment, June, cashing 3,400. Now we are on entry details page. Let's click on three dots icon at the top right corner. Now we have three options, move entry, copy entry and copy opposite entry. Let's first see how to do move entry. Let's tap on move entry. Now here you can choose the book where you want to transfer this entry. Okay. So I'm selecting yearly revenue book. So I'm moving from company payments to yearly revenue book. Let's tap on move. So now app is asking you to choose the entry creator. This is happening because the entry is created by someone else and not you. So in this case, entry is created by Shivam. So you can choose between these two options. First option says keep original creator. That means when entry goes to another book, Shivam will remain as a creator of that entry. Okay. But if Shivam is not a part of that cash book, then he will not get access to that cash book. Only his name will remain on the entry. So don't worry about it. If you choose the second option, that means when entry goes to another book, you will become the creator of this new entry. So I'm choosing the first option and clicking on continue. Yes, I want to move. Now it's done. Entry moved successfully. Uh, now we can open yearly revenue book and check. So you can see new entry has been added here, which says Kumar payment June. 3,400 rupees cash in. So this is how you can move entries. So now let's explore other options. Let's go back to company payments cash book. Now let's say that I want to copy Rajesh payment June entry to another cash book. So I tap on this entry. Let's tap on three dots. Now let's choose copy entry. By copy entry, we mean that entry will remain in both books. So the same entry will get added to another book, but it will stay in both books. So let's click on copy entry. This works like a copy and paste. So let's choose a book where I want to copy paste this entry. So I'm choosing yearly revenue, copying from company payments to pasting to yearly revenue. Let's click on copy and paste. Now again, the same question. So again, I'm choosing the first option, keep original creator. Let's click on continue. Yes, copy and paste. Entry copied successfully. So let's open yearly revenue book. You can see the new entry has been added here. And if you go back to company payments cash book, the entry is still here. That means entry remains in both books. Now let's see the third and final option which says copy opposite entry. So to understand this option, let's go back to our cash books. Now I have one cash book, which is called company bank account and another cash book called cash in hand. So let's go to company bank account. So as you can see here, there is one cash out entry, 20,000 rupees, which says for general expense, that means I took out some money, which is 20,000 rupees in this case for my general expense. So let's assume that I took out this money and I put it in my pocket. So this should go to the book, which is called cash in hand. Now here it is, it is cash out entry, but in the cash in hand book, it should be cash in entry because money went there. So let's tap on three dots. Let's click on copy opposite entry. Let's choose cash in handbook and let's click on copy and paste. 
yes opposite entry copied successfully now let's tap an open cash in hand now you can see we have new entry here which is a cash in entry of 20000 rupees now if i go back to company bank account the cash out entry of 20000 rupees is still there that means same entry got added to cash in hand book but it got added as a cash in entry so the entry type will get reversed in this case now let's go back to company payments cash book so i will just quickly show you how to multi select entries and perform the same actions on them so let's long press on any entry now one is selected i'm selecting another one so i selected three entries two entries so you can see the number here now we have the same options here move copy copy opposite and delete so let's choose copy this time so i'm tapping on copy so copy and paste two entries so let's select home expenses book this time so copying from company payments pasting to home expenses let's tap on copy and paste yes two entries copied successfully let's open home expenses so you can see the two entries are here now say so payment and travel expenses so this is how you can move copy or copy opposite entries to another cash books if you have more questions regarding this click on three dots on home screen go to help and support and click on contact us this way our team will help you thank you